All new here at 6. This year is nearly over, and yet some Floridians tell us they are still waiting on unemployment benefits from the start of the pandemic. ABC Action News reporter Heather Lee has been leading our push to get claims in front of DEO officials since March. And all new tonight, she helped a Polk County man get the money he's been waiting for for months now. With frustrations on the boil, Luis Lopez may finally be getting somewhere when it comes to his unemployment benefits. It's crazy that you have to get to this point for somebody to, to do something to help you out. Lopez was furloughed from his job at Disney in April. He's been there for 14 years, and in October, he found out they weren't bringing him back. Uh, put in so much time and effort and, and being a, a good employee, you don't expect something like this to happen. And with the food and beverage industry still taking a hit, Lopez says finding a job has been difficult. On top of that, his unemployment benefits have been on hold since May. And like clockwork, every time he claims his weeks, he calls DEO to find out what's going on. It takes from, from an hour to two hours just to to try to speak with somebody. He says at some point DEO was telling him the reason his funds were being withheld is because he went back to a job Lopez says he's never been employed at. Why you keep telling me then, then I went back to Home Depot when I never worked there. Then I'm for luck for Disney. Fed up, Lopez and his wife reached out to ABC Action News within 24 hours of sending his claim and ID into the DEO. They're going to release my funds. Then everything is, is going to be uh, clear and going back to normal. They say his money should be in his bank account within 48 to 72 business hours. Heather Lee, ABC Action News.